Spotted lanternfly continues to sp spread throughout the state, damaging and threatening crops. Two local counties have been added to the fly's quarantine zone. Arvin Hinkley shows us how the insects could affect our region. The spotted lanternfly is no longer knocking on Central PA's door. It's here. Both Blair and Huntington counties are now part of an expanded quarantine zone, highlighted in blue on this map. Fly infestations are found in both Altoona and Huntington Borough. It's just going to make your life miserable because when it eats, it's going to leave a honeydew on everything around it. It's going to be sticky. Uh, it has a black odor. It smells a little bit. But more than that, it can wreak havoc on specialty crops like grapes, which aren't an extremely popular crop in the region. Still, we're told the fly could get an appetite for other crops. They're still going to continue to feed. They're going to find something else to feed on. Uh, we, we know they, we think they like hardwoods, but that doesn't mean that they're not going to uh, to decide they like soybeans or corn or, 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 or all your flowers in your yard. To keep the fly from spreading, new policies are in place in both counties. Anyone who does business out of the counties, like trucks, produce, or even news crews, must get a permit. Even those traveling to different towns in the same county have to have a permit, which are available for free online from the PA Department of Ag. After the online training, you'll know what you're looking for and how to kill the insect. The goal is you smash it. But the inspection process asks a lot. Not only do you have to do a, an inspection when you get in the vehicle for, to, to start out the day, but every time you stop, every stop you make you're to do it, an inspection prior to moving that vehicle again. After that, you're to call and report the spotting to the PA Department of Ag. The PA Farm Bureau recommends that you allow them to treat the area with what they say is a safe chemical that can help stop and control the pest. Reporting in Blair and Huntington Counties, Evan Hinckley, WTAJ News. Right now, there's no word on how many populations of flies are in Blair and Huntington Counties.